A massive fire raged through a Surrey apartment building last night, forcing about 100 people from their homes, and it will be some time before they are allowed back inside to see what they've lost. The flames were first spotted around 10.30 last night and spread quickly as smoke billowed into the dark sky. I heard some people scream, there's a fire on second floor. People inside the building urgently alerting others of the danger. I knocked all people doors so that they can come out from the building. Everybody say, get out, get out. This is all I get out. That's all I got. I have nothing. Once out safely, distraught residents could only watch helplessly as their building burned. I lost all my hope, all my hard work. Whatever I had, it's all gone. There are many elderly people who live here. Those with nowhere to go were taken to the Newton Senior Center. Some 40 firefighters were needed to help battle the blaze. Gone into the roof area, which has made it challenging for us uh, because of the void spaces and also some collapsing in the roof area. The fire is still not completely out Sunday morning. There's a lot of crews in there uh, trying to identify uh, hidden fires and um, put out little hot spots. Fortunately, no one was injured and even some pets lost during the chaos of the night before were found alive, including a cat and here inside this box, a bunny. Investigators believe the blaze started on a second floor balcony. It doesn't seem suspicious at this time, but they're still investigating the actual cause of it. The amount of damage is still being assessed, but it will be some time before it's safe enough for residents to go back inside and see what they can salvage from their homes.